Red Rocket Felix tends to It's a little bit loud. I feel like we're about to go 3D World Runner on this bitch. Look at that giant ass tennis net on the, in the background. It's gonna be a, oh. I can be John Macaroni, Mark Chang ground, ground strokes, net play, Lisa Star volley, Fred whoop smash. Oh, he likes smash. I think I'm a, I should be him. Libra Garcia backhand. That's. You should probably not be named after your pip slap. Omar Strato baseline. We're gonna go with Smash. Mm, this one looks the least ugly. Smash. Sm uh. Smash. Uh. Yuck! A rat. What the hell? Outside? Fuck you and your outsides. Background. Dudes with attitude. Big fun. Huh. Well, I'm not a tennis guy. In case you hadn't already known that. But this seems playable. I like this run animation. Failure to stop me. Also, save states, obviously, but still. Ah, oh, fuck. How do I smash? Is there like a, a secret button for smash? Maybe it's just a natural thing. Ooh, ooh, ooh! Maybe that's a smash. Man, that's like an asshole move. Just get up to the net and fuck it up. Nope. Doesn't work super great. Yeah, this game seems fine for what it is. I've played much, much worse tennis games. Stop tripping over the ball, me! playing this 50 hundred times, however many it takes. I think we've seen enough of this, by far. I did not notice any dudes with attitude despite the advertisement in the background. Only nets, and tiny ones, not even as big as the intro screen. Come on, you've disappointed me. No, just kidding, this is... If you like tennis and are in the 80s, this would do great. Kill it! 
Murder! Oh. You did your best. Chiogoku Jensi story, Tanku. Wow, this is loud. Did I like turn up? Oh, I did. Everything's fine. Everything is as it should be. Config? I feel like this is going to be one of those life board games. A long time ago, in a galaxy far, far away, there lived a little Chinese, Japanese town. I should say Japanese, this is Japan. And in this town, there lived a little midget guy, and he was like the coolest one of all the midgets. And it was time for him to go hang out with his buddies and play Mahjong, apparently. And here they were, doing just that. When suddenly, one of the other guys got a horrible wrist cramp from playing too much Mahjong. And it was up to, uh, the midget guy to win the tournament. Because he was the only friend of that guy, and he needed to avenge him. Dancing man, dancing man, says he's going to beat us. But the dice say otherwise. I watched Fernan play Mahjong on Tabletop Simulator, and I mildly remember what I'm supposed to do. Mildly. I do not remember the whole fucking north, east, west, east, south thing at all, or what most of the symbols mean. But it's basically just Jin Rummy, otherwise. Gotta get the sames, or in a rows. Good luck fucking knowing what's in a row on the left there. What am I supposed to do? I have one of those, so I wanna keep this. Let's get rid of that. Yeah! Um... Let's get rid of that, I guess. Oh, come on, really? That might have been useful. So... Can I, like... I don't seem to be able to claim anything at the moment. Okay, so that's a three. Uh, I don't remember what any of these numbers are. I think that's nine and ten, maybe. No, that's eight. So I got two eights. I think. Maybe they're tens. I think, or nines, even. They might be nines. Because I remember one through four. So that might be five, six, seven, eight, nine. If so... I'm gonna keep that, just in case. Blank? What the fuck does blank do? Huh? Why? What, what just happened? Is that a four? Is that a really fucked up four? Um... No! I wanna keep it. Get rid of this. 
I want to, like, do the thing. God damn it! We're all in on these motherfuckers. What? Oh, did I win? Or did he win? I don't know who won. It couldn't have been me, right? I guess it was me. I guess I had all the things I needed. <laughs> Let's get rid of this garbage. Uh, I don't know what the bamboos are. Fuck the bamboos. That's a one. That's probably a five, I think. And an eight, not exactly great, but yeah, fuck that. Yeah. Okay, let's get rid of this. Regret. Ah! Rewind. Let's get rid of that. And this. And that. I want any of those. None of them. I would have had three of those! I probably won't need those. Yes! All my hopes and dreams. I didn't- I don't think I won this. Unless I had a, just had a better hand. This is- this is not the Mahjong I know and don't care about. I don't think any- even neither of us won. So, this is like some sort of poker Mahjong, I'm guessing? With limited pieces. I don't know how to use whatever that is. This hand, though, holy shit. Fuck the bird. Yep, keeping that. I don't know what the goddamn blank does. I don't think I'll need this. An extra three. be a wild card or it might not. I don't know what to do with it. Uh, uh, mm. 
Uh oh. Is it like equal? What? What happened? Why am I still playing this? What am I doing with my life? That's a four, this is probably a five. I think we're missing the six, actually. No, that, that's probably six. I, mean, I think we're missing a five. Seven, eight, nine, probably. I don't remember the fucking. Let's get rid of that one. Watts. Ah, yeah, there we go. Two tree pair. You've got a bunch of twos. Not as good as three pairs, I think. I win. I won the tournament, or maybe. And with minor cheating. Only minor. Oh, you're fucking crazy. Oh, uh, double snake eyes. <laughs> That's not what that means at all. I wasn't even one snake eyes. Well, we kind of won a battle. I think that's enough Mahjong, honestly. Whatever Mahjong poker's going on, that I barely understand enough to have just kind of won. I think we've seen enough of it. The end. Maybe that's a bit too loud for my poor ears to hear. Do, 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 do. 122 and 121 right next to each other? That's a little weird. Dual orb! Oh, I forgot to do that. The game we didn't get was Dual Orb 2, which came before Dual Orb 1 for some reason. Purpley didn't want to do any of the hard work. I'll just be your supervisor, she said. Unfortunately, unlike Dual Orb 2, this one didn't say it was translated. Oh wow, we're in the nursery. Oh man, we're too old to be in the nursery! I better get the fuck out of here! What is on second from the left guy's face? ZZ Top reporting here on the scene from the nursery in the middle of the storm. As you can see, the woman who gave birth to 12 kids had two abnormals. Most of them looked just like the parents, but one had a weird thing on his face, and one was blonde and didn't want to be in the nursery. That's really all I have to report on today. But I was slated for five minutes, so I'm going to keep talking anyway. If you look on the right, we will see a foot trying to escape the blankets. That is no good. You're going to wake up with a cold foot. Put that foot back in the blankets.
Everything else looks calm still. Nine out of the twelve babies realized that they needed to be- Oh wait, we got another foot that has escaped on the bottom. There are eight babies left being normal. Four defective babies so far, folks. Blondie just doesn't know when to fucking stay asleep. Tossing and turning like nobody's business. Does being blonde make you more susceptible to storms? I don't know. Is the guy with the thing on his face even alive? I don't know. Anyway, I don't know what else to talk about. I'm ZZ Top. Been two minutes now. Still got another three to go. Uh, okay, we're done with this. ZZ Top is tired of the scene. Also, let's welcome back the uh, air conditioner, which you can probably hear in the background because it's loud as hell. Wait, did the baby with the thing on his face become this old man? Were we not really babies? Were we just like us being like teachers of 10 kids or something? Old man! Oh my god, that's supposed to be a beard. It really is. Where's his fucking eyes? He has no eyes. He's just all fur. It's all fur. No face. It looks like somebody just took a brown, like a, oh, not a brown, a, a gray dookie on his face. It's terrible. You are confined to this corner of the mountains. This is my punishment. I had to go take a whiz on this tree. I'm not controlling this, by the way. Still not in control. We gotta watch this guy drunkenly stumble back to his house and be scared of it. And we can't do anything about it. No, we cannot. Oh, that's a nice dookie dragon statue. Lots of dookie in this game. I wish I knew what to do with this dookie dragon. Why was I sent here? But that's when the purple gumdrop fell from the sky. Why did it have to be grape? I am the great gumdrop from the sky. I will help you learn what to do with this dookie dragon statue. Just pop me in your mouth and chew vigorously, and I will give you the power to blow the answers from your lips. Once it pops, you will know the truth of all things dookie dragon statue related. Sorry, I can only do one thing at a time. I'd love to give you the answers to life, the universe, and everything, but you know, whatever. It makes so much sense now, he said as he walked back from his house. The only thing to do with this dookie dragon statue is nothing. Let's just leave. Did you do what you had to do with the dookie dragon statue? Okay, come back to town. It's time for me to tell you about why there's a dookie on my face. For once I was your age, and I'll, I also had to go to the Dookie Dragon statue, but I made the wrong choice. That's what all those dots mean. I made the wrong choice, and the Dookie Dragon statue took a Dookie on my face. Now I'm the old Dookie beard man from this village, and I have to teach all the youngins not to do what I did. But I can't just tell you that, or, you know, the lesson isn't learned. I'm glad you made the right choice and got yourself some grape gum. You leveled up. You are now the Grape... Grape Gum Wizard? I don't know. I feel like my mic might be a little too loud. Just a bit. Anyway, now you must save the world with your gum powers. Have fun. Oh, hey, I can move now. What do we got? 20 HP. One used gumdrop. Uh, ah. Stats. Okay. 
Looks like that's probably defense on the left, then. I'm gonna guess the first one's attack, and for some reason wearing... wearing farmer clothes makes your attack go up. We have no tech points. Ooh, message speed, please. Well, goodbye, Dookie Dragon Man. Uh, I think I chose the slow option. Let's try that again. Uh... Yeah, that's better. That's much better. Well, no use, um... Wow, the way Diagonal feels is so wrong. No need to talk to any of these doofuses. Let's go to this town over here. I don't think I have any money to buy this stuff with. I would like a better weapon, because I have no weapon. I have no money. Great. I'm gonna have to just beat things up with my fists. Let's do that. And then stop playing this, because it's going to be turn-based, isn't it? It's got to be. Yep, there it is. What in the hell are these? Oh wow, one whole damage. I feel like somebody was supposed to give me money. I'm gonna get destroyed by the first thing outside of town because I don't have a weapon. This isn't viable! I must go back to Dookie Face. Did you forget to give me my allowance, sir? Maybe somebody in that first town. Can I just rent a sword? Infinity cookie! I would like it an infinity cookie. Wait, wait, what? I have one? I had a sword that whole time! Did I unequip it or something? Well, son of a bitch. Let's go to church where I will probably get healed and beat up the weird things outside of town. I don't want to say, but maybe if it'll heal me, it's worth it. Nine whole minutes. That's too much. Uh, no, I don't want to save again. Thank you. Did you heal me? Am I healed? No, I am not. Help! I made a mistake earlier. I got beat up. I need... I need an in. Old man, help! I need, like, cookies or something. Maybe I can use that used gumdrop. Let's try using the, the used gumdrop. I cannot use the used gumdrop. Regular person. Oh, oh! Free stuff! A hundred gold! Oh, bye! You didn't see me. Absolutely. Let's see if I'm right about that being what I need to heal. D did I not buy it? I 
did buy it. How do I use this herb? Stop having me. Oh, you have to check out here. <laughs> Interesting. So all three of these people are just like, it's like Walmart. They're just, they just work here. Oh, fuck yes. Okay. What do y'all got? I don't feel like that's any better than what I already have. Ooh, but they got a stick. I want a stick. Give me your stick. I probably can't even use your stick. It's probably for another party member, but I'm buying it anyway. No. Nope. Oh yeah, it is better. Got me a stick, bitches! Let's go beat the fucking shit out of those motherfucking... ...mushrooms or whatever. We probably won't run into them. We'll run into something else. Yes! Let's fight! Oh, come on! You're gonna make me beat up a, like, puffball? Do it. They must die. I am such an asshole. Forest Puffball! I want to beat up the mushrooms. Where'd the mushrooms go? There's one. That'll do. Whoa, no, 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 no. Uh... I can't choose my targets. Oh well. Die! I have avenged my previous fight, or whatever. We even made it to the second town, which is more than I usually do in these RPGs. Hooray! We saved the world! From a mushroom, a slug, and two puffballs. And there's a cat. I don't remember kanji. I mean, I don't remember katakana, so I don't know what that says. It's probably Nya, but I can't promise that. That actually looks like a two. I don't remember what that is. It's been too long. I didn't care anymore. I should play that game again. Is that kid naked? Are you wearing a bra? What is this? Well, I guess this is my life now. I'm gonna live with this granny. That's the end of this game, guys. Hope you enjoyed. ZC Top Out. <laughs>